I'm Cameroon, and this is What's Happening and What's Up in the Counter-Strike World. That clip is from the last round played in the Grand Finals where Team Solomon put the nail in Virtus Pro's coffin and gave them the first place finish. Last Friday, October 2nd, Team Liquid, Fnatic, VP, and Team Solomon met in Bucharest for the Season 1 Finals of PGL. Team Liquid placed 4th and Fnatic took 3rd overall. Surprising many, Fnatic fell flat this tournament and didn't make it into the Finals, having lost in the first round to Team Solo Mid and then again to Virtus Pro in the lower bracket Finals. VP put up a fight in the Finals but couldn't take a map away from Team Solo Mid. Don't feel bad, Pasha. No one did this tournament. Team Solomid came into the finals confident, having already been blessed with a one-map lead, having won their way through the upper bracket. VP's plow was trying to get traction, but I think Fall Weather got stuck in the tracks as Team Solomid went on to win 16-12 on Train, and then 16-12 on Overpass to finish out the tournament. Team Solomid takes home $40,000 and some confidence after a strong showing. Team Solomid's Finn Kerrigan Anderson showed his excitement in a post-match tweet after the tournament saying, yes! We finally won a tournament again after three months. GG Virtus Pro didn't lose a single map this tournament, impressed by my team. HLTV.org has several videos featured on their channel with interviews from Taz and Team Solo Mid as they get ready for their matchup. We'll throw the links in the comments below if you want to check them out for yourself. Unfortunately, Team Liquid weren't able to get a win this tournament, but I believe that Hiko and the gang will step things up in their next showing as they've gained some valuable experience against the world's top teams. They just need to take the time and prep for the future now that they've got a baseline set. If you had a favorite moment from the tournament or any of the events that we're talking about in this episode, tell us in the comments below. I Buy Power is hosting a tournament November 14th through the 15th in Santa Ana, California, held in the eSports arena. The tournament is showing $100,000 as the prize pool, giving $65,000 to first place. Cloud9, Renegades, Conquest, Winterfox, Counterlogic Gaming, Complexity, Luminosity, and Team Liquid will be competing for the lion's share of the prize pool. This tournament is setting the battleground to determine who's really number one in North America. It's definitely a weighted prize purse, as second place is getting $25,000, with third and fourth getting $5,000. I Buy Power goes on to mention on their website, we feel that North America deserves the competitive attention the rest of the world is getting, and we are glad to bring it to Southern California. I'm glad to see that North America is getting some attention, and I hope this motivates teams to push themselves to the limits. In addition to the CS tournament they have going on, they're mentioning an I Buy Power eSports day where they'll have events and giveaways for the community at no charge. If you're in the area or are planning a trip to California sometime soon, I'd recommend checking this out. We'll find some pictures of the experience to share with you after the tournament in November. Catch the tournament as it happens over at twitch.tv forward slash iBuyPower. November seems to be the month of tournaments. Announced October 6th, RGN is going to be hosting a CSGO tournament featuring a $30,000 prize pool and 16 teams in all. They're hosting the tournament in Santa Ana at the eSports Arena. No, that's not deja vu you're experiencing. It's the same place as I mentioned in the last article. Get this, it's also going to be held from November 16th to the 18th, the day after the iBuy Power Cup. Mentioned on HLTV.org, the league is wrapping things up after the summer tournaments have finished as they're bringing in the top four teams from each league to duke it out. This means you'll see CLG, Luminosity, Renegades, CSGO Lounge, Cloud9, Team Coast, Winter Fox, Team Liquid, Method, Games Academy, Complexity, Conquest, Enemy, Quetzal, CLG Red, and Swarm. 
This event will be streamed on azubu.tv forward slash GoRGNTV, and tickets are on sale October 10th if you're planning on extending that vacation a little longer. Or if you're in the area, grab a ticket and enjoy the tournament. The eSports Arena deserves some recognition as they're bringing some awesome CSGO tournaments together, and we'll get to see what the location really looks like on the inside. This tournament and the one mentioned before have a common theme here, and if you picked up on it, they're both focused on North American teams. It's becoming obvious that there's a big push in the scene to get more recognition and showcase the talent that we have. As I mentioned before, this could mean a North American major win in the next year. I'm really feeling it. If you think you know the first North American team that will take a major, put your guess in the comments below. Announced by himself, Warren Hades Redditch is leaving Follow Esports after a dispute with the organization. Hades leaves behind teammates Ocean, Els, Wabbit, and Desi amid rumors that he's been given offers from other organizations. On Twitter he said, Due to unfortunate circumstances between me and the organization, not the team, I will no longer be playing for FE. I wish the best of luck to Hades in his CS career and Follow Esports now has to find a replacement for one of the core players in their team. Will this impact their performance on SEVO or ESEA? Is this a better move in the long run? Only time will tell. We here at What's Happening What's Up always appreciate your comments, so if anything in the episode really jumped out at you, please don't hesitate to post that right below. As for now, I leave you with a moment in CS, Pasha having fun in Counter-Strike. No, 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 this is Sneaky Mickey, this is Sneaky Mickey. <laughs> I'm not camping, man. You f***ing no. camper! No. Aye! No. <laughs> camper! <laughs> you camper, my friend! I only see your big head! <laughs> you are not looking like you signed Bolt, my friend, so don't run again! <laughs> no, you camper, JW! <laughs> you stay on the... <laughs> <laughs> Camper, my friend, I'm looking for you. Hold them up. <laughs> no! <laughs> no way! What a comeback! Play same again? Yes, do it. Come on, maybe the next map. Give the give another map, man.